anxiety day. I'm so nervous. <laughs> Someone got it. What? Welcome everybody. I just want to thank everybody before I start attacking my peers. Thank you so much for coming through to um, today to share in our beautiful celebration of love that Shirley and I have for one another. Wow, I'm really, really grateful that everybody came. <laughs> I was kind of nervous when I woke up this morning because I thought, geez, imagine like only half the people come. It wouldn't be a good reflection on Shelly and I, but thank you very, very much for making the effort to come out and share this very, very special, momentous occasion with us. I tell you what, you can give yourselves a round of applause, please. Well done, guys. Thank you so much. I'd like to say a few words tonight before I spend the next 30 years of my life listening. <laughs> you haven't got a turn tonight. You just sit there. <laughs> Firstly, I'd like to just say how absolutely thrilled I am. You know, this light is bad in here, and my eyes aren't great. I'm going to do something. <laughs> I went for my um, renewal of my license test the other day, and I don't know who's done that in the last couple of years or weeks or months, but there's an eye test you do, and there's a joystick, and you've got to look through these, these two holes, and there's an E that's either pointing up, left, down, or right. And I thought, I'm just going to pretend I'm playing TV games from my youth, because I couldn't see this E. And I went left. I went down, I went left again, I went right, and he went, okay, stop. And I thought he was going to say, can you see that thing? And he said, well, you passed. <laughs> and I went, that's fabulous. So my license got renewed. <laughs> Pardon? So what was that? <laughs> My bad. <laughs> Concentrate. I just want to tell you how absolutely thrilled I am that you've been upgraded. <laughs> From our princess to my queen. <laughs> You're beautiful and you are radiant. I've never, I actually have never seen you so happy as you were today. I, and I, I, I know I wrote that down, but that's the truth. <laughs> but I haven't seen you as happy as I do. You look just like Muriel, right throughout our wedding. <laughs> Shelly Ann usually allows me to be the center of attention when we're together, but fornication, Evie. So for this occasion, <laughs> just threw that in there. Um, it's all about it's all about her, and today I stand here so humbled and so blessed to be your husband, and finally be able to call you my wife. I just want to thank Cameron and Brandon. You know, you guys have given me your mom, and you've been so welcoming to me. And it's been an unconditional love to be received into your family. Cameron, please just inform your soccer mates that your soccer mom is now taken. And she's off limits. I couldn't have wished for two better role models, Cameron and Brandon, to be an example to my son to follow. Really love you guys. Cameron and Brandon, thank you so much for the gift of your mom. I'm going to thoroughly enjoy unwrapping her tonight. <laughs> so 
Some people uh, try things once in their life. Some people will try the same thing for the second time, even as they failed miserably the first two times of asking. <coughs> they get hit the champions. <laughs> Those who try and try and try and try and try again. My beautiful friend, this is the only time in my life where I'll listen to you and you tell me, Grant, this is your idea. <laughs> Seriously, for a couple of seconds, this is a really special moment. I want to take this time out to honor my mother and my late father. We played the flowers the flowers garden earlier today in honor of our dad, and tonight we get the opportunity to personally thank you, Mom, for making all this possible for us. Your unconditional and overwhelming generosity is unmatched. Thank you for letting me share myself with the passion that you do. Thank you for making sure you feel so unbelievably welcome in our family. I know for sure how much they have to love Chili. And how much he would have supported us here today and for our future. Mark, you really do look amazing. So young and so beautiful. Thank you for raising me right. You are one in eight billion. <laughs> and thank you so much for coming all the way from George to be here tonight. So we everybody charge your glasses and we raise the toast in my mom. Come on. <coughs> and to that. Cheers. 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 Thank you. <coughs> I've heard such incredible, incredibly beautiful things about Shelley's mom. We know how much you would have had being part of your social life today, my child. You speak about it with so much warmth and love in your heart. And another part of your mom. I like everyone there to raise a toast to share with their mom, Judith Ann. Yeah. 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 To Judith Ann. Yeah. Cheers. Yeah. To share these bad wine, turn in and to the bars and go around. You both look so beautiful and I want well, you know what guys, I've been to a few weddings in my life. <laughs> uh, I'm not young, but I'll tell you this, I have never seen bridesmaids as beautiful as you guys. It was absolutely stunning to see you walk into the church. Thank you. The support that you guys show Shelly, and thank you for assisting her today to look as beautiful as she does. I know how much the two of you need to her, and um, words just cannot explain how much we both love both of you. Thank you so much. We'll get to the test. That's all we can to my best man, Evan, my friends from George and I see and Evie, you were my friend. Thank you for standing next to me today and thank you for being such a rock to Charles and I. Your friendship surpasses all understanding. We respect and we love you. Georgie, you've come such a long way since that 3am sprint on the side of the field to the lake where I began to get to know you and realize already then what I'm here today, do one of a kind. COVID took you away from our business, but didn't retract from our friendship. Thank you for always being here for me, no matter what.
Amen. Thank you for everything today. Your infectious personality and your enthusiasm make the perfect candidate and the choice that we will make here for you today. Thank you for being such a good friend. And thank you for the support that you've also shown to Charles now. Say, Charles, Charles, see, Charles. Can we please raise the toast to the bridesmaids and to the groom, best man, groom to the best man, and then see. Thank you guys. Cheers. Our darling Louise, Louise and Spongy, pay attention and won't stop talking in the corner. Thank you for performing our inspiring ceremony that you did for us today. Your love for our family knows no bounds. And we are so appreciative for everything that you do for us and we are most grateful for everything that you've already done. Thank you for putting your foot down and keeping Tony off the golf course today. <laughs> really, really do love you. Tony, thank you for being there. Right. To everyone of you who traveled to be with us today, these are formalities, guys. We're getting to be a good bit now. But um, to everyone of you who traveled to be with us today, to Chris and Penny, I know this is your third trip. <laughs> We promise it's the last. <laughs> Ryan and Debbie, Charles' sister and husband, have come all the way out from the UK. He's on our world famous entrepreneur. He's flown in from Canada. We want you to know how much we appreciate your effort and most importantly your enthusiasm about attending our wedding. Thank you. Always? That's the only thing. Jay's other sister, but unfortunately, we couldn't be with us today due to her daughter having just been married in the US. And our half hour message I received from Bev's Bev is that um, money just doesn't grow on trees. <laughs> there's, a, there's a number of people who have traveled from out of town, not just Chris and Benny, but my brother Gavin and Felicity. Um, my long staying mate Theo, who made the trip all the way from Dubai. Oh, my. Oh, my. <laughs> <laughs> and so thank you very much, guys, for coming up and making it to be here. <laughs> to my mate of 43 years, the guy who has single handedly turned my beard grey and my business partner. Don't leave you in person. Thank you so much. Flying from Qatar and Jerusalem cruises to Cape Town, Cape Town. Thank you so much for being here. There's one very, very special, amazing human being that I would like to thank for being here. This woman has been a rock in Shelley's life from a very young age, and has been there for Shelley through some difficult and trying times. In the time I've gotten to know her, I can see why Shelly has always said that Auntie Lisa is her second mom. She's traveled from some new show to be here with us. And I'd be very grateful if you could all raise a toast to Auntie Lisa. Thank you for such a great job that you've done, Lisa. Cheers. You know, I can't see any of you. <laughs> I'd also like to just mention a uh, very special thank you to Amy and Irene for coming through. We absolutely love you. We wouldn't be the same people without you guys in our lives. We know that's a long time. We love you very, very much. We've got another very special couple in the house. But I have to raise a toast to. And that's what I would say. Thank you for allowing us to get married on your wedding anniversary. So happy anniversary, by the way. Right. Can we get 
is the real reason why we're here today. My bride, I was so you know, you would have got a mention. Well, you have a different chance, but no, I'm sorry. <laughs> The real reason why I'm here today, my bride, my wife, the love of my life, and my very best friend. How beautiful you really, really do look today. What a privilege it is now to call you my wife. Ladies and gentlemen, may I now please introduce to you all Mrs. Shelley Ann Wilson. I actually met Chevy just over eight years ago on a blind date. She was actually just part of the entourage of women accompanying my blind date. <laughs> All of this, including the fact that I didn't know that I was actually being set up at all, went to the really see on my way to have a drink with an ex work colleague. And when I found out that I was, in fact, on a blind date, a little panic set in, and I met I ever successfully managed to avoid it. The most incredible thing about Shelly is that she's taught me to trust love. I'll say that again. The most important thing about Shelly is that she taught me to trust love. In fact, I often be the kindest, sorry, person I've ever met. Shelly, however. Yeah. <laughs> Have a moment, though, when she makes, uh, which makes her the person she is in the character that is Spain Ventures. Mm -hmm. I mean, who wouldn't fall in love with someone that while on the back of a motorbike with me and Tyler, and this took the motorbike seat she was sitting on for a toilet? Ah! Oh! 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 Shelly, by our own mission, has the worst geographical sense of any human being on this planet ever. And I mean, ever. <laughs> when Shelly's general knowledge, again, geographical, comes into question and is related to having a massively overly full bladder, she refers to it as the Zambezi Dam is allowed to explain it. I said, don't you mean the Zambezi River? She replies, that <laughs> My soul shows her affection to people by calling them chicken. <laughs> she's not telling me you be better when you're scared or you're a coward. She's using her general knowledge of life by referring to you as a bird of love and peace. <laughs> 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 Shelly, I love you. Thank you. <laughs> I'm honored, I'm blessed, and I'm humbled to be able to call my life. I love you, Mama. My chicken. My chicken. Can we all please stand and raise a toast to the most amazing, beautiful woman that is my life? To you, my life, Shay. Thanks guys. Um, my request to you all tonight is that you have a fabulous evening. Please drive home safely. Please enjoy your evening here. Um, we really appreciate everybody being here. Love you for every single one of you sitting there. You're important to us and that's why you're here. So thanks for making the effort. It means the world to us. Love you guys. Thank you. Love you.